Hey guys, what's happening? Buddy Love here with another player review and this week it is Lovetsi, the Argentine from PSG. This guy was near extinct pretty much all of last week, then come the last day of Team of the Week and there was literally pages of him. I actually opened up a lot of packs and couldn't find him and now the market is absolutely flooded with him. Oh man, I wish I could take back buying all those packs but oh well, that is that. Now, let's move on to the team that I used him in. I used him in a 4-3-2-1 formation, built up of a Bundesliga, Liga, and Serie A players. He scored me 7 goals in 11 games and set up 5 goals in the process and cost me 126k. Now let's get on to his in-game stats. As you can see, he's a very well-rounded player. But the stats that really stick out to me are his 89 sprint speed, mixed with his 94 balance and 73 strength. That allows him to hold off defenders that can catch him in a foot race. Lovetsi is also well equipped having 4 star skills mixed in with 4 star weak foot which gives him a bit of an edge over any of the other left wingers in the league. Now let's get on to how those stats reflect, reflect in game. Pace. He felt quick with that 89 sprint speed but at the same time the 86 acceleration really showed as he needed to, like a bit of a space just to motor up. So as far as pace is concerned, it was much of an up, wasn't much of an upgrade when compared to his original card, which was a bit of a letdown. Now he's dribbling. It was good for me, but it didn't really feel as good as the base stat of 87 should have. He reminded me a bit of Gareth Bale in terms of, the, in terms of dribbling, as it felt like he couldn't weave in and out of plays like, like the way a, a Quadrado or Hazard could. Now onto his shooting, which I felt wasn't that flash. I got into a lot of good chances with Lovetsi and at times not only did he not score but he missed the goal entirely. It probably took me about 3 games to score with this guy and even then it took some getting used to. Which is funny because when I use his normal card I find his shooting to be pretty good and for some reason better than the informed version. Now onto his passing which I felt was ok but nothing overly crazy. Maybe if I played him in a left mid position, I would have gotten a better taste for his passing, but for me it felt like he could make the simple passes, but never made a pass that opened up the play to create a good chance for my team. Now the stat I think shows the most improvement and makes him worth owning is his physical stats, which I think make up for his lack of dribbling and pace. This is a stat that makes up for his downfall in other categories and allows him to either bulldoze players or hold them off if he gets caught by pacey defenders on the break. Now onto his pros and cons. His pros were he had good strength, 4 star skills and was a very well rounded player. His cons were his dribbling felt stiff and his shooting wasn't as good as his normal card which was a massive letdown. So my overall love rating for Lovetsi is 7 out of 10. I didn't really enjoy playing with him that much and I probably won't use him again. Now if you liked the review, please like, subscribe and comment. And that's all from me. Stay classy. Thank you.